Hello and welcome to Add to Cart. This is Brian and um, I've got some camera here for you to look at. This one here is the GE E1410SW Full HD. And we bought this camera back at Christmas time for my daughter. And we had, I'm used to dealing with cannons and the power shots. And I've had a Canon power shot for a really long time. And this one's price was very attractive. Uh, less expensive than the power shot. And so I thought I'd give it a go. It's less than $100 and bought it on Amazon. And again, it was going to be for my daughter. And it has been. Uh, I mean, it takes good pictures. It really does. It does take good pictures. It's got a lot of different settings and things. The the video is, is really nice. It does full HD and 1080p. So, I mean, it's got a lot of different features that are, are really good. But should you add this to your cart? Well, this is not a review. This is not an unboxing. This is not a first impression. This is something that we've lived with for a while. And I would say no, go ahead and pass it up. Although the lens is really good, it's got a great zoom. Um, it really comes out nicely and it's really got a long travel as far as the zoom. Pixel, the pictures are not very pixelated. They're, they're very good at that, at that range. Um, but for the price, uh, I would say Go and go ahead and get you a Canon or get you an Icon, get you something a little more uh, name brand, I guess is a good way to put it. I have not been impressed with the the features on the like the menu system and things of that nature. It's got this blurry effect over here. I don't know if we just got a, a bad one or or what, but the menu system is a little more difficult to navigate through, and it is not as as user friendly, I guess is a good way to put it. But uh, but it's for the money. I mean, I think it's a it's a good camera. If this is your only option, I, I think you'll do okay. But again, the, the pictures are, are good quality. But and I'll flash some pictures up here so you can see that the quality is good. But as far as the the software, I guess is a good way to put it. The software inside the machine is not as good. The hardware is good. Uh, the battery life's okay. Um, it doesn't get that, that that flashy washed out thing when you have the flash on it. So it's it's good in that regard. But I think you can do better with a Canon Power Shot. And again, that's just speaking from personal experience. So don't add this to your cart. Uh, look around unless you just really need a, a camera that is less expensive. Thanks for watching. Hope this hit, helped you out.